Ooh. Morning, everybody. Hi. Marshmallow. Beep, 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 beep. Boop, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. All right, let's do my name in Morse code. Uh, Z. Beep, 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 beep. And then um, A. Beep, beep. Then C. Beep, 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 beep. Ah! And then H. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Anyways. The next part of our journey is upon us. I may not like it. This is the part where I'm terrified. Because all the other stuff's been, oh, wow, look at all this cool stuff. This next part is terrifying. Because we have Feldspar. We have uh, both of these vessels. And they're all located on the Dark Bramble. Also, you found a dead Nomai in a spacesuit near the South Pole. I did find a dead Nomai. I can never spell marshmallow right anymore. Yeah, that is true. That is a confusing word. So the, so it's interesting that they make their pilgrim pilgrimage there every year. They everyone he said everyone makes a pilgrimage when they get old, but he says he was the first one to get that close. Thank you, Marshmallow. <laughs> Gosh dang it, Marshmallow. Anyways. Today, I'm scared. This is the first time we're heading to the dark bramble. Gosh, I am so afraid. So this one, so this is the only planet I haven't been to. This planet has so many terrible things. Um. I don't even know how how you go about this planet. It is a very scary planet. This isn't a horror game, but Honestly, I wouldn't put it against my myself to be a little nervous. Oh. So the thing about this planet is that it's, I don't know how, but it has angler fish, which are those stupid fish that have the lights at the end of them that lure prey in and then kill them. I don't know how you have this on a planet like this, but. I'm just kind of taking pictures of what we got. Um, let's use, let's do the uh, quantum fluctuation thing. No, 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 the stress beacon. Apparently 700. How is it so far away? I guess we have to go deeper. All right. There's only one way. We gotta go 
deeper in. Look at the stars just dying in the background. You see that? Oh gosh, there's a light. You see that? Oh, man. It's only one way to find out, right? Keep the keep that keep that uh, equipped. This is actually terrifying. Test A. What, did you make your name all caps? Gosh, there's absolutely no gravity in here. There's a light, there's a light. Whew. I'm so terrified. Why am I terrified?
Don't go to the lights. Holy crap, they're everywhere. Don't go to the lights. Oh. Goodness, they're everywhere. Yeah, let's, let's launch a thing, shall we? Let's launch a thing at him. I think that's how you leave, actually. Let's just think of the light, the white lights. Hello. Oh, come on. Get past that thing, at least. Oh my gosh! Come on. Well, oh, there's an anglefish. See that? Oh my gosh! That is terrifying. Holy moly. Okay. Signal scoper. Alright. The beacon is there. That one. Alright. Just as long as we don't come across. Okay. I'm just concerned for everything. I'm just gonna hug the wall. Is it okay if I hug the wall? The entire time? I'll be fine. We'll be fine if I just hug the wall. Yep, okay. Hold on, I need to get inside here. As long as there are no lines between us, should be fine to so just go ahead and enter it, right? Uh, hang on. Lights. Many. Distant lights. They're distant, though. How is anyone supposed to... I mean, yeah, you could just beat through it, but I am actually terrified, so. There's a moving bit. Why is there a moving bit in here?
never been more careful. Well, I've been pretty careful. Where is it? Oh. There it is. Oh, there it is. It's right here. It's right here. High power. Okay, okay, okay. Let's land, let's land. Inside here, shall we? Okay. Our skate pod crashed as we tried to. I tried to flee this place, De destroying our movements and communic. All right, our skate pod crashed as we tried to flee this place, destroying our movement and communication abilities in the process. We've held out as long as we could here, but this pod supply of breathable air is nearly depleted, and the anglerfish attack more and more frequently. Our best chance of survival is to return to the vessel. Our best chance of survival is to return to the vessel to either repair the damage or, more probably, wait, wait, rescue. Seka, as the mess is finished, the vessel's beacon is already growing fainter. It will be gone in a matter of hours. Uh, we need to leave here quickly, though. Oh, gosh, this area is intense. Just because of just what I've heard. Okay. Okay. Now launching Escape Pod 3. Escape bot three. Uh, vessel has been mortally in, uh, mortally injured. Emergency sequence activated. Away to departure from vessel. <laughs> now launching escape pod three. Multiple collisions have altered. Yeah, it's a donations thing. Uh, text to speech. Multiple collisions have altered pod directory. Significant so damage to pods detected. Navigation error. Life support error. Propulsion error. Scanning external environments. Scan complete. Gravity not. Detected, breathable air not detected, multiple life forms detected, potentially hostile verdict, do not exit pod. There's a new problem. Our equipment is detecting two distinct beacons. Our equipment is detecting two distinct beacons from the vessel. But this is impossible for the vessel being two different locations at the same time. I agree. But the beacons are exactly identical to each other. Perhaps if I had more time. We're nearly out of time already, Din. The vessel's beacon is quickly fading. Soon it will be gone and we will be lost. We need to follow the beacon whose source is nearest to us. But I suppose that beacon is... But I suppose that beacon is false. We likely don't have enough air to reach the farther the two beacons did. The decision is made for us. We'll leave a... We'll leave a trail of lights as we go. There's still a chance someone could hear our escape pod distress signal. Let's get emergency escape hatch. Huh. There's the trail of lights. Alright. We know what to do. Alright, where's our ship? There's our ship. There's our ship. Oh. Okay. Up we go. Okay. Follow the trail of lights. Uh, where was it? Where 
Where's the trail of lights? There, 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 there. Keep our, keep this out, please. I am so inc Oh my. Oh, they went to the wrong one. That's the real vessel signal. To any who come searching for us, we followed one of the two beacons from the vessel to this place, but now can go no further. It's almost too faint to hear now, but the vessel's beacon is still faintly emitting from within this thorny seat, yet the opening is too small for even single one to fit through, so our escape pod couldn't have flown through here. I don't understand how this could be possible, but this gruesome place seems able to manipulate space itself. Maybe this was our undoing. To be so close to the location of the vessel, and still so far is difficult. Worse, the vessel's beacon is dying. Soon, we'll be unable to hear it. There is nothing we can do now but try to find a way inside, or at least attempt to comprehend why this happened. My dearest hope is that the other escape pods were able to reach relatively safely. Yeah, they all died here. And there's the real signal. 1.4 kilometers away. Oh. It is very sad. It's a sad game. Well, it's not really a sad game. It's just, uh... One that is a mess. So to speak. Are you the last human? Well, this isn't even my kind, but you could say I am, technically. Um, I'm like a different species or whatever. All these people died before we were came to uh, came to be. Uh, hold that thought for a second. I'm going to a black hole.